And hello everyone, this is the All Gaming Blog and uh, here's another Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. Now on this video in particular I want to talk about the console peripherals not being utilized to their uh, full potential. Uh, what I mean by this is the Microsoft Connect and the PlayStation Move not really being used and there's not really that many uh, games that could potentially utilize this. Now, in a previous video of mine, I've mentioned something about the ga video games market right now is too saturated with sequels. There is no new game genders. There's all you know. It's always the same coming over and over again. And uh, Ubisoft CEO, uh, on an interview, he blames basically the console gap that there is between uh, one console coming up to the to next to being a five-year gap. Basically, he, he blames it on that. I honestly blame it on the lack of originality and simply not using what we have right now. Because one thing, okay, we don't, we the, con the, the consoles that we have right now are outdated, not really the best. We we could have had better and whatnot. But the thing is, we we still have some certain uh, peripherals or certain things that we could have used that we don't use. Uh, for example, the, on the PlayStation Move, I, I would love to play Call of Duty with the PlayStation Move, with a, a gun attachment to the PlayStation Move controller and just shoot people with, with it. I would love to do that, but I can't because uh, Call of Duty won't support it. I don't know how that would work for the Kinect, really, uh, but I imagine it would be something similar to that. I mean, the Kinect was a bit different and it was firstly used for video games, but people aren't really using it for video games, they're just putting it on the computer, on the PC, and just, you know, doing different things with the Kinect, so... Okay, did they, they, they really didn't made... You know, they really didn't sold that much, and not many people liked it anyways. But nevertheless, you know, they exist. We, we have them. And I think, I feel like a lot of the new games that come out uh, should come out with a PlayStation Move support. At least for the PlayStation 3, uh, should come out with a PlayStation Move support, and they don't. And I don't know why, really. We we have the technology. It's it's right there. We have to, you know, the development kits. We we have everything to go. Then why don't why don't we, you know, just have the games? Um, I'm not. I'm, I mean, I know there's games coming out for the PlayStation Move nowadays and for the Kinect. They're still developing them, but they don't really develop much. I mean, the, the developers don't don't really utilize this as much as they, they could or they should I mean for shooter games oh yeah okay you know y you could use it with a gun attachment or whatever to basically just you know to shoot people and whatnot but um you could like Diablo 3 has still hasn't been released on console and I don't think it, it will be at any time soon or by the time it will be released nobody will play it because everybody is gonna move on you know to bigger and better tanks so, but I, what I see in my head, I think is Diablo 3 should be, could be, could have been released for, let's say, PlayStation 3, and could have been played with the PlayStation Move instead of using the mouse. You could use the PlayStation Move as a mouse. That, in my head, that would work. I mean, I don't know. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this. But in my head, this would work. This would definitely work. Uh, if if you really just, and it's gonna destroy my center gun, but I'll kill him right after. Um, you know how hey, this would work? This would work fine. Some games that probably don't are PC compatible only could have been compatible with the uh, PlayStation used by utilizing the PlayStation Move. Same thing with the Kinect. They could use the Kinect instead of using grabbing, you know, uh, a move controller. You can just do it with your hand or whatever. I think they work. They would have worked. And I don't know why they're not being used. Why they won't consider them? And I don't know why the Call of Duty series will not. Uh, support for the PlayStation Move. I would love to play it. I probably would suck at it and probably wouldn't be very good, but I still would like to try it. I mean, I have been playing, uh, and I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say this. I've been playing this 514 with the PlayStation Move controller, and I'm gonna get the gun attachment thing. It's just a plastic attachment for shaped like a gun where you put your controllers in. But um, I'm gonna get it and I'm gonna play it, try it out, see how it plays. So far, I actually liked it. It has pretty good accuracy. And uh, yeah, I just I would just like to see more games utilizing it, more games you know using that technology. And that, for some reason, I'm dismissed with that predator. But um, 
I would like to see. I don't know why they don't do it. In some games that do, it's just people won't really play them much, anyways. I don't. I don't think it's because they don't. They're not any good. I just think because ma not many people uh, know really about this this attachment, or many people don't have them. Some people might say that these these are just gimmicks, and uh, in a way, yeah, they are gimmicks. They are gimmicks for for the companies to to put out uh, in between times. From the consoles don't show up, but um. I don't. I don't know. I mean, all the new consoles that are coming are gonna come out, they're gonna have uh, these gimmicks. Basically, they're, they're all gonna have uh, PlayStation Move 2.0, Kinect 2.0, uh, Wii U is gonna have that iPad with buttons, gamepad, dengue, You know, they're all gonna rely on that in the future. So, you know, why not rely on it right now? And I thought I had the final kill cam, but uh, some Elmer Fudd on my team had it. Oh well. So um, yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Thanks, for, thanks a lot for watching. Let me know what you guys think uh, about this in the comment section below. Leave me a like if you liked the video, and please do subscribe if you want to see more.